Hi Rackstars, I'm Diego and in this tutorial I will show you how to visualize the data of your Wisblock starter kit in UB.s dashboard. In the previous tutorial we've connected the Wisblock to the Things network console. If you have missed it you can find the link in the video description. Now let's start this tutorial and visualize the data from TTN in a more user-friendly way. First, sign into your UB.s account. You can find the link in the video description. Here in UBDOTS, we can create a plugin that is needed for the integration. From the Devices menu, click on Plugins. Click on Create Plugin and select the Things Stack. Make sure you do not select the Things Stack gateways, as this is for gateways. Click on the Greater Than icon. Select the UBDOTS token. In this case, we will use the default token. Click on the Greater Than icon to continue. On the last page, you can change the name and the description of the plugin. We will leave it by default. Now, navigate to Decoder menu. Here, copy the part of the HTTP's URL after forward slash API forward slash web hyphen hook forward slash to your notes as it will be needed later to create the integration. While still in the UBDOTS page, Click on the icon of your account in the upper right corner and click on the API credentials. Copy the key you have selected for the plugin. In this case, the default token. Now, go to the Things Network console and navigate to Applications, Your Application, Integrations, Webhooks, Add Webhooks, UbiDots. Give the webhook a unique ID. In the plugin ID, paste the previously copied part of the HTTP's URL. And in the UBDOTS token, place the default token from the UBDOTS. Click on Create UBDOTS Webhook to create the integration. After the integration, the status of the webhook will change to healthy. This tells us that the connection has been successfully established. Go back to the UbiDots website and navigate to Devices. Here you will find the first device in the list. You can click on the device and see all the data that the WISBLOCK kit sends. Now let's create the dashboard where you can visualize all the data. Navigate to Data, Dashboards menu. Click on Add New Dashboard. Give a name for the dashboard and click Save to save the dashboard. In the new dashboard, click on Add New Widget. Here you can browse the widget you need. In this example, we will create a widget for the temperature. Click on Thermometer. Click on Add Variables. In the new window, select the WISBLOCK kit. Select Temperature and click on Select. Click on Save to add the widget. You can now see the temperature in the dashboard. You can do the same with the other values. You can also edit the appearance of the widget as you like. And this concludes our tutorial on how to visualize the data from the WISBLOCK starter kit in UB.s dashboard. We hope that you enjoyed this quick tutorial. If you want more of this, comment down below and stay tuned for more tutorials.